Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. It's uh, Eric Kaufman. I'm talking to you from the Metal Investors Forum, November 2018 edition from Vancouver. Uh, I'm here with Robert Justra from Allegiant Gold. Uh, Allegiant, I would say, is a, a, a drill spec slash news slow story. Both of those things are near and dear to me, as my subscribers know. Uh, maybe you can walk us through, you, you sort of designed Allegiant when you spun it out from Columbus right. to, to be all about drilling, I suppose. Um, can you sort of give us an overview of where you're at? You, I know the, the idea was that you, and this is a fully funded program, that you would be drilling six different projects. So where are we now in that process? Right. So the, the game plan from the onset was to leverage the experience of our management team uh, in um, prospecting and identifying um, discovery opportunities uh, and drilling those opportunities. So all our projects are drill ready, all 14 of our projects. We're focused on six uh, that are being funded by Goldcorp. Goldcorp recently acquired a 10% interest in us. Um, and it's a 10 to 12 month program and we're just starting on our third project now. And to be clear, the, the Gold Corp investment was a straight up equity investment. They, there is no project interest for them. Yeah, it's not an earn-in, it's a straight up equity investment that gave them just under 10% of uh, okay, so uh, ownership. So they wrote region. a check and got stock, essentially. Exactly right. Now, it does come with some rights. Uh, if we ever deal any of our projects, uh, any of those projects that they have an interest in, mm -hmm. uh, they have a right to match uh, offers, third party offers. Maybe, and maybe you should speak for a moment, uh, you know, I'm obviously well acquainted uh, with the gentleman who put your project set together and, and who's designed a lot of the programs, but I mean, you want, you want to talk a little bit about, about Andy, since this is, this is a Nevada project set, for those of you that aren't familiar with Allegiant, the projects being drilled are all in Nevada. Um, Andy's had a bit of success. He, he has. Uh... Um, Andy is a principal of Cordex, which is our exclusive exploration partner. Uh, Cordex was founded in the 1970s by his partner, John Livermore, who found the Carlin mine, which started the whole Nevada gold rush and makes Nevada um, uh, what it is today in the gold mining industry. It's really the best place in the world to be if you're in gold mining. Um, Andy Wallace was his first employee. Cordex uh, is credited with nine discoveries. This is after the John found the Carlin mine and five of those discoveries were under Andy Wallace's management. And they raise, they, they, they vary from a million to I think almost 13 million ounces at Stonehouse Lone Tree which is a project now owned by Newmont. Okay. And we're in early November now. I mean we'll get this video out fast. Uh, can you give us a sense going from early November 2018 What's the news flow going to look like the next couple of months, six months? Right, so we're drilling um, about a project every six to eight weeks. Okay. Uh, there'll be a break at Christmas. Uh, we just completed drilling at Red Hills um, about four weeks ago and uh, um, I have just moved the drill from the second property, Hughes Canyon, to North Brown, which I, I think is probably our most exciting discovery opportunity. Um, so you're going to start to see some drill results this month okay. and you should see press releases on that discovery drilling I'd say about every you know four to eight weeks. And is there any, I mean you just mentioned one project, I mean are there a couple of targets dead ahead that you, you want to touch on a little bit? I mean things that you're really excited about? Yeah well as you know we haven't talked about it, we own Eastside which is you know has one and a half million ounces but specifically on the discovery drilling, I mean realistically Eric you know, you've been on this business for a really long time and you know discovery drilling, you got to drill a lot of targets to make a discovery yeah. and um, realistically if we drill six we may make, you know, we may find on one project something that's pretty significant yeah. and probably end up dropping four or five but this is, this is the process you have to go through to make new discoveries. Right. Okay and is there, are, there any of the, are there any of the specific ones that you're that you're, that you're most excited about? Well, um, what excites me is what excites Andy. If he's excited, I'm excited. Right. <laughs> You've okay. met Andy and he doesn't get excited very easily. Uh, but he's genuinely excited about a project we call North Brown. Okay. It's on the Battle Mountain trend. It's just outside of Eureka. There's not a historical drill site uh, um, anywhere uh, on the property. No drill holes. 
Um, uh, it's a prospect discovery by Andy and his team. Um, uh, up to nine grams in float and up to four grams in outcrop uh, in a geological setting that Andy describes as one of the most prospective carlin settings to host a large gold deposit in Nevada. Mm -hmm. So that's exciting. Um, it's hard to find those kind of grades just sticking out of the ground in Nevada these days. Yeah. That's, that's uh, one that they found um, very recently. And, and just in, in closing, I guess we should, we should touch on Eastside because um, I mean, I'm, I'm talking about a legion as being a sort of a drill play, but you do in fact have a fairly sizable resource under your belt. We do. I, we offer discovery opportunity, but we also have uh, and a more advanced project that easily justifies our market capitalization, which by the way is undervalued at 20 million. Uh, but Eastside has 1.5 million ounces uh, in various categories, uh, 300,000 ounces is historical, a half million ounces is still geological, um, and 720,000 ounces uh, is in the inferred category inside the pit. And it, it adds up to about one and a half million. Um, the deposit is open in every direction. We performed some drilling earlier in the year to demonstrate that it does continue, the gold does continue west and south, and it does. Um, the project is located in an area of amazing infrastructure. Uh, it's a dream location to find a gold mine, really. Uh, the highway between Reno and Vegas runs right through the property. Uh, a power line runs through the property. There isn't a tree in sight from a biological or archaeological environmental standpoint. It really is uh, a great place to build a gold mine. There you have it, a uh, million and a half ounces, six drill programs, fully funded, uh, recently spun out from another company, so you sort of have a, I guess, a fresh shareholder base and a fairly tight float. Uh, Allegiance is something you definitely want to be paying attention to. Thanks very much, Robert. Thank you, Eric. Okay.